Hi, I'm going to quickly demonstrate the new ES4 mode in the Silent Wave Voice Controller plugin. Um, let me load the plugin up first on this MIDI track in live. Uh, set the monitor to in so the keyboard is uh, recognized. So here's the familiar Voice Controller plugin. We've got this new ES4 um, button here, which um, gives you these new ES4 mode controls. So I'll turn that on. On the synth, I'm just going to plug in some really basic connections to the ES4. Um, I'm going to put my CV in input 1 and my gate uh, on the ES4 is input 2, which is how the voice controller outputs are mapped um, by default. And what ES4 mode does in the voice controller is takes the first five channels of the voice controller's output and combines it into the stereo signal that goes through the SPDIF cable to the ES4. Um, now, normally at this point with the voice controller, we'd have to run the calibration. Um, because the ES4 is hardware calibrated, we don't need to do that. We could do if we wanted to, but it's more accurate just to press this button, which creates uh, a calibration that is perfectly in tune for the ES4. And the one last thing we need to do is to add an audio track so we can actually hear the keyboard, the synth that's coming through. There we go, back to the voice controller. And now we can play the synth. Like so. Um, now, it, it being the voice controller, we've also we've got three more outputs we can play with. So, for example, we could use the uh, envelopes. So, I've got uh, another cable here, which I'll plug into the ES4's output three, which is connected to the filter cutoff. So, uh, if I wind down the filter. We've now got uh, envelope control of the filter through the voice controller. Right, so so that's um, it's as simple as that to get the ES4 working uh, with the voice controller now, with no need to actually calibrate. Cheers.